name is Alejandro Velis. I'm a lecturer in digital design and fabrication in the School of Art, Design and Architecture. I'm Professor Catherine Willis. I'm Professor of Smart Cities and Communities in the School of Art, Design and Architecture. I'm Elie Zoe. I'm a project manager in skills and outreach at Plymouth College of Arts. We've been working on a living lab approach with the city, particularly around our Green Minds project, but also creating a space where we can experiment and prototype and co-design with local people and local organisations. So Plymouth has an emerging digital kind of ecosystem across the city. It's not only about the industrial sector with a high presence in areas like marine, for example, but also um, areas like the immersive sector, manufacturing. There are growing areas in the city and the region and that positions us in a quite unique place. Today is the very first uh, Plymouth Fab City Open Day. Uh, so we've gathered uh, 13 different organisations and projects from across the city uh, to open their doors to visitors and tell them a bit more about this global initiative uh, which we've joined um, in 2019. Uh, we were the first UK FAP city uh, to join the international network and we're committing to becoming locally productive and globally connected by 2054. So we're really delighted. I think FAP cities like the initiative within the city is fantastic and it really aligns with all this work we've been doing around the Living Lab with the Green Minds project, for example, but a whole other approach around the teaching and the way we work about bringing bringing the university out into the city and out beyond the sort of ivory tower and talking to local people and um, showing them the benefits of all the, the opportunities there are with innovative digital technologies and how that links to our teaching offer and how our students are benefiting from that as well. The university has quite strong links with the local industrial kind of ecosystem including business managers. We run certain projects that specifically deal with access to industrial networks including the Plymouth Manufacturers Group and the IMA Flower Project that the university runs alongside the Plymouth College of Art and the Plymouth City Council in order to provide business support in the digital and immersive sectors. The Fab City principle is really looking at uh, the current uh, system where we sort of uh, make, we take and we waste. We've got key cities in the network that are been super pioneers already and are having great results like uh, Barcelona in Spain or Paris in France. Uh, they've got districts and neighbourhoods with like a fab lab here, a fashion lab over there, a food lab and that's really how you organise yourself as a city to really become locally productive. So fantastic initiative, definitely something to get involved in.